it yourself or a shop should have. What is that? It's a multimeter. And today we're here in the shop with this MM300. It's by Klein Tools. It's a nice little multimeter and it's got a lot of nice features. You know, multimeters can be expensive. This one's very economical. It's in a nice hard plastic shell that supposedly is able to take about a three foot or more drop without breaking. It's got a little stand here on the back so you can hold it up. Also on the back here, your leads can snap in real nice and tight that way so they're always uh, kept safe when you're not using them. And you got a lot of nice features here. You can turn this thing off here. Then you have your uh, voltage here for AC. This is your high voltage. This one goes up to 600. Then you can test diodes or you can use this for continuity. So you hear that, that means you have a complete circuit. You come down here, you have your uh, ohms reading, I'm sorry, amperage meetings, readings. So with your common lead here, you can go up to about 200 milliamps with this one. You plug it up over here on this side, you go up to 10 amps. As you move further down, this is a nice feature. This is to test batteries. So if you have old batteries around the house and you wanna know what the voltage is, here you go. We'll be able to tell real nice with this uh, battery here, it should show somewhere between six or seven volts. And there you go. You also have your typical ohm reading. So if you're trying to measure resistance here of a resistor, you can do that. And when it's not in use, turn it off. It's nice and safe that way. So again, if you're a do-it-yourselfer, you have a shop, this is really a nice tool to have there. It's very useful when you need it.